And did Attorney Sherman tell you that you would never get arrested? Absolutely. With that murder? Absolutely. And after you were arrested, did Mr. Sherman ever tell you that the case would never go to trial? He did, and he did it in front of, um, it was on the 18th hole restaurant at Lob Lolly uh, Country Club in Florida, in Hope Sound, Florida, and it was in front of a woman named Tara Knight, who I believe is an attorney here in the state of Connecticut, who immediately stood up and said, Mickey, you cannot tell him that. This is going to trial. And he said, I oh, don't, and then she got up and walked away. And he said, I oh, don't listen to her. She doesn't know what the hell she's talking about. I'm telling you, this is not going to see, you'll never see the inside of a courtroom. Did you ever read the 1,800 pages of the police reports that were provided to Mr. Sherman by the state's attorney's office? Um, I would have needed, I would have needed it put on tape because I'm dyslexic. Um, I, Mickey would have known clearly that I was registered for a place in Roselle, New Jersey that puts any and everything I have on tape, or at that time it did. So no, he didn't. And did Attorney Sher uh, Sherman ever ask you to review any of the discovery in the case for accuracy or inconsistency? I was not only asked not to read any of it, but I was kept away categorically from all, pretty much all business with had anything to do legally with this case.